Let's find out how we're accelerating biotherapeutics research on this World Tour of Innovation. We're in the thermoscientific technology exhibit talking about MABs, and this is an area of tough analytical challenges for our customers. I'm with an expert, Remco Smart. Welcome, and thanks for joining us today. What we want to talk about first, I think, is the challenge with anal analysis around MABs. First of all, the monoclonal antibodies are rather complex molecules, so you need a whole a range of analytical methods, for instance, chromatography methods, to characterize them. And the challenge for the most labs is that they need to, to characterize a lot of antibodies in as, as short as possible time. So what we have developed are instruments and solutions to process and analyze many of these antibodies in as short as possible time. Most of the companies are focusing on what they call hands-off time. So they want to automate as much as possible of their complete workflow. And we have developed solutions for that. Those solutions are based on this instrument, the Ultimate 3000 uh, MAP solution. So what it can do, basically, it can analyze and purify antibodies, fractionate them in any kind of well or well plate that you can think of, and then do a re-injection on a second column. And the beauty of this is that you not only purify them, but you can also characterize the antibody based on a different array of uh, chromatographic methods, such as reverse phase, ion exchange, or size exclusion. And size exclusion gives you, for instance, the state of aggregation of the analyte, and ion exchange gives you the variant analysis of the molecules, which are extremely important to develop these antibodies as a potential drug for, uh, for healthcare. The system is controlled by Chromelian software, and this is controlling all the different steps of this workflow. So injection, fractionation of the compound, and re-injection on different columns to get the whole characterization of the analytes. If people want to do the detailed characterization, the detector becomes very important. And most of the workflows rely on UV detection. But if you really want to know the detailed characterization of the protein molecules, you need to rely on mass spectrometry. And in that case, you interface the Ultimate 3000 to, for instance, a Q-executive mass spectrometer, where you can get a very detailed uh, pattern of the amino acids and the modifications that are required for the FDA to know. Learn more at thermoscientific.com slash dionics.